What the fuck? Fine, sure. On my way. He said he'll come. Thanks, V. Sorry about that. Uh, I forgot to pause when I did the thing, so yeah, here we go. You'll miss a little bit of a dialogue. The thing was, I literally out tab and started taking some notes. Because really, I think it is, it's time for quote unquote me taking notes about how I'm gonna do this review because. There are things. Uh, let's see which one is close by. Not this one. So it's gonna be probably... Gonna finish this. Then I'm gonna do following the river. Then I'm gonna do... Blistering Love, I think that's the name of the quest. Like the one that you are jo Johnny Silverhand's wingman. That's something that would be very strange to explain to... Look, it's not that I got laid, it's not that I slept with a uh, rogue, it's was Johnny Superhand. That's fucking convenient excuse. If you think about it, they can do shit and Johnny is gonna be the one who gonna end up bl getting blamed by it. Ugh. Like they're not, he's killing me, so fuck. He's gonna take the blame for a couple things. But yeah, sorry for the the miss uh, missing the dialogue of the beginning of the, quote unquote the beginning of this quest. But yeah, I'm taking notes. Uh, I really taking notes, and I'm never. I did it that for a couple games, but this one is the first one that I really sat down to rewrite notes and stuff like that to do the review because. Boy oh boy, Cyberpunk is different. And I don't know, uh, if you play this game or something along those lines, I really wish to know if it is, if it is just me or someone else is feeling that there is a lot on the cutting floor. Okay, Johnny. This fucking weapon rocks. Let's do that too. NCPD subcons. Suspected organized crime activity observed in the Hello. region of Goldsmith Street. Scavenger presence reported, led by one Barry Alkin, wanted on charges of first-degree murder and illegal trade in cyberware. 
NC authorities offering payment for neutralizing Alkin and his accomplices. Okay, where is the motherfucker? Stay safe, Judy. No, you're not. Uh, let's go to see what we have. Now, let's finish the job. I kinda wanted to kill Aladdin's measure with that pistol. It's a matter of honor. But I think we're not gonna kill him. Maybe? Maybe it's, it's the last boss fight. 
poetic, not gonna lie. Still everything fine, still everything is still fine, okay. My god, can you go slower? Rachel's been waiting for you. What's going on? Joshua all right? Don't fucking know, don't fucking care. Get in there. Where do I go? Straight down this street, building with the officer out front. Thanks. Okay. you look more I don't know professional fuck you whatever get in don't worry Olga we'll fix this trust me we'll be on schedule helps on the way finally we're late Stevenson's been asking for you all day he's in his dressing room go talk to him <sighs> Fucking hell, what the hell is happening? Wanted to see me? It seems you're the one friend I have. What does that say about me? What exactly is going on? What am I doing? Why, why am I here? Or maybe I am insane after all. Got pure intentions, I know, but you're putting them to waste doing this. Something like this. Just not worth you dying for it. It's too late now. There's there's no going back. I'm, I am so afraid. Will you pray with me? A prayer of your choice. Fine. Fine. Sure. Our Father, who art Our in heaven, Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come. Thy kingdom come. Thy will be done thy on earth done as it is in heaven. On earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our give daily us bread. This day our daily bread. And forgive us our trespasses. And forgive us our trespasses. As we forgive those who trespass against us. We forgive against those us. who trespass against us. And lead us not into and temptation. Lead us not into temptation. But deliver us but from deliver evil. us from evil. Amen. Amen. Time to start. Let's go. I truly hope Zuleika is praying for me now. Will you stay with me? To the end, I would like you to wield the hammer. Nail me to the cross. All right, Joshua. I'll do it. <gasps> Thank you. <sighs> Let's do this. Fuck you. You're gonna have to say some lines. A few. We'll put them up on the prompter for you.
Are you not the Messiah? Save yourself and save us. Do you not fear God? You stand condemned under the same sentence. Mate, if you want to stop, just say the word. Father, forgive them. For they know not what they do. We are punished justly, for we receive what our deeds deserve. But this man has done no wrong. Remember me when you come into your kingdom. Truly, I say to you, today you will be with me in paradise. Fuck you, John. <laughs> Mate, that's heavy. <laughs> Father, Father, into thy hands I commit my spirit. Amen. Probably my hardest gig, that, but I got through it. What now? Going home, where I'll sleep for two days straight. Be in touch about your compensation soon. You shouldn't release the BD. The world shouldn't see it. That's not up to you, that's not up to me. I'll call you. Boy, that's... Fucked up. Let me see. Let's go eat something, and we're gonna go on a date with Rogue. <laughs> Am I considered a third wheel on this one? That was a strange mission, to say the least. Hey. 
Yeah, I'll do it. That wasn't really, really what I expect on the game, but fuck. We just crucified a man. Kinda heavy, huh? And hell, we did a lot of stuff. I just hope that in whatever happens, the guy is in the place that he wants to be. And yeah, we were talking about a fucking video game, but roleplay a little. Again, uh, the thing is, cyberpunk is not about saving the world. It's more or less about saving yourself. Yeah, that, that's interesting. Now back into the notion of uh, what the hell we're do about the game. I still have the feeling that some things are in the cutting room. And simply because this game did so fucking goddamn well, a lot of those things may never see the light of day. And maybe, which was, I don't know if it's worse or not, this may be the last big uh, flare of CD Projekt Red, because, well, release-wise, this game was a mess. Still kinda is, and no matter what you think, like I, the game is enjoyable, I'm having fun, but... Saying the game is perfect is would be bullshit, no matter what. And not saying, not admitting then yes, there is problems. Would it be worse to the game? Well, the fact is, right about now, CD Projekt Red or thinking about uh, complementing this with the multiplayer mode. And I'm afraid, because it, it will be a lot of money. It will have microtransactions, and because of that it will have a lot of money. Hmm. I think it was here. I just really hope that... Well... Wait, what? Right, I'll wait. Hey, how's it going? Over here! Glad you're here. I need your help cooking. What's on the menu? No, you don't. Jambalaya. Come on. You can stir the meat? Um, soy meat? Okay. Dunno. Maybe Joss would be more help. Joss did her bit. Just grab the damn spoon and start stirring. Boy. This an ancient ward family secret? Uh-huh. Onions, paprika, thyme. Just need to mince some celery and garlic. But you stir, please. Stir. <laughs> I'm stirring, I'm stirring. Bet my socks you've never had better jambalaya. How's, uh, Randy holding up? 
He's looking for his old self. Physically, though, it'll be a long road before he's back to full health. And, uh, mentally? That was some experience. What Harris did to him, fucked as this might sound, might have helped the kid. Could be wrong, but feels like a clean break for him. Honestly, I thought you were kidding about the cook-off. Where the Joss had sweat away in the kitchen while... Oh, Joss doesn't know the first thing about cooking. Actually, I like to torture foodstuffs. <laughs> Haven't had many opportunities lately. Don't mean to spoil a nice day, but I gotta ask, what about Peter Pan? You're asking if I killed him. We'll talk later, okay? Sure. No pressure. It's just I, uh, you know. I know. So? All right. Think you've stirred enough? Mind grabbing the rice from the kitchen? Yes, sir. No, Randy's always been that way. But I'm sure this didn't help none. You know, his father was a difficult man, too. That's exactly what I told him. But he always got the same speech back. Nobody cares about these kids who don't exactly fit the mold. In those words, yeah. Wanted to tear my hair out every time I heard him. And when can I visit again? Uh, where'll I find the rice? I'll call you back later. Really nice of you to come. Uh, thanks for having me over. I should be thanking you. Looking good, Joss. Really think so? Thanks. How's Randy? Still in the hospital. Still in shock. But he's making progress. Haven't had a chance to tell you just how grateful I am. It was all River. I just helped. I just don't know how to repay you. If Randy uh, had... Don't owe me a thing, Joss. <laughs> I'm so quick to break down. Yeah, it's fine. Anyway... That's Maddie, nice. nice. Right there. Tomatoes in next. Now you can toss in the rice. Rice is in. Okay, now this has to bubble and brew. Patio. This is a good guy. Grab a chair. And a beer or something else. It's nice out here. Yeah. Seems all good. Like nothing bad ever happened. Tell me now about Harris. I paid him a visit at the hospital. He's still in a coma? Yep. In a strange slumber between life and death. An empty shell in a hospital bed. One shot to the head. Quick and clean. I had the same thought. It would be so easy. I pressed the gun to his head and remembered something. River? How my parents died. Sure you want to hear this? What happened? Old man had a farm, like Harris's dad. But when business took a turn, well... My parents managed to open a small grocery. We lived on the floor above. A loud noise woke us one night. Oh. They wanted cash. 
Register was empty, so they stormed upstairs, forced us all to kneel, and demanded my dad tell him where he hid the money. River, you don't gotta go on. Heard sob stories enough? No, just... This is tough, I can tell. You really don't need to rehash it now. Okay, yeah. You're probably right. Just... Harris. What did you do? Had the gun to his head, and... I've ended a few lives in my time. But never like that. Never an execution. Slipped out of the hospital quick. Told myself the case was closed. That's good. But what now? You're not going back to the PD. P.I. has a nice ring to it. Who knows? Uncle River, we'll you said you'd play with us. You promised. All right, all right. Let's go. V, join us? What are we gonna play, Uncle River? You'll see. This is not gonna end well. Dorian, we're playing! Yeah, big trouble in Haywood. Grab your set. What the fuck is this? Well, what do you think? <laughs> Always wanted to try a game like this. Well, well. Nice firepower there. This is no time to get distracted. We can't let that filth get away. Who? Oh, well, look at you. V. Allow me to introduce Captain Joan McLean and Lieutenant Henry Callahan. They're our precinct's best and brightest. Wouldn't want to get in their way. I always work alone. No exceptions. Even for you. Yeah, me too. Ooh, I've heard of cops like you. The lone wolf type. That's right. Thorns in their commander's side. Rebels who play by their own rules. That's amazing. I've been suspended one time, retired two times, and kicked off the force three times. I'm getting too old for this. <laughs> but something always drags you back. The city needs me. This guy's amazing. All right, let's get to it. All right. All we gotta do is track down El Chamuco in Diablado and take out his lackeys along the way. He'll pay for his crimes. We'll play like two teams, us and the kids, but we work toward the same objective. The team with the best result wins. You don't stand a chance. Hey V, just go easy, okay? It's their favorite game. Sure. Okay, <laughs> let's let the kids win. Oh, there he is! Get him! The city's mine! You'll never take her from me! <laughs> He's fast, but not fast enough to escape justice. <gasps> Watch out! It's cronies! Not half bad. <laughs> let the kids hey, win. I have better aim. Next round, next round! This way, it must be their rat-infested hideouts. I could smell the moral decay from a mile off. Mm, quiet. Too quiet. It's a trap! They were waiting for us! Not half bad. <laughs> But next time we gotta be faster. Ah, shit! Out of the way, citizen. Obstructing justice is punishable by law. This is your last warning! Easy there, Captain. I'm just passing through. Not far now. 
in there, Callahan. I can't afford to lose one of my best men. Don't worry about me. That all you got? Nuh uh, watch this. I'm losing. It's the first time that I'm losing, and I'm doing because it's fun. Okay. Lunch is ready. But mom, you almost had him. Oh, you'll get him next time. At least we beat the grown-ups. We're the best. Thanks for letting them win. They had fun. Nah, they're great kids. It's no problem. Seems they took a liking to you too. Hey, food's on the table. Are you gonna die in the middle of- Oh, come on, don't make me die in the middle of the dinner. So, was your game fun? Awesome! <laughs> we kicked their big butts! The bad guys? Huh? Oh, yeah, the bad guys, too! Time to see if this tastes as good as it smells. Unemployment's being good to you. You seem good. River's discovering the joys of family life. That and police duty. Never a good mix. This here's a way to get some of those years back. I haven't seen him this... untroubled in a while. What about you, V? You got a family? Or just relations? Used to see family as baggage. Something that'd hold me back, you know, career first. Didn't do any better for not having one, though. Nothing's more important to me than my kids. I've made mistakes. Life's gone off the rails sometimes. Always does. But I had my kids. I got my kids. Speaking of... Be great if Randy was here. Won't be long. Randy loves Jambalaya. Joss, you see me being a parent ever? Never. I mean, I don't exactly look like good palm material myself, so... Yes! Who says yes? I do. <laughs> he raised his hand himself. <laughs> v. Are you seeing someone? Involved? Fess up, please. Um... Well, that's decided. Yes. Got an 1199. Officer needs backup. Come on, pull you out of this ambush. Thanks, Joss. Yeah, thanks. Whew, situation was getting dicey. That's what partners are for. You were about a hair's breadth away from having to look at photo albums. You're just getting out of doing the dishes. Admit it. Also true. Which gives us two reasons to go. Here we are. What are we looking at? A water tower. Great spot. For? Here for what? Having a drink? Shooting the shit. Good. Let's keep that away. This way. I oh, fuck. Gate stuck again. Gonna fix it one of these days. Let me give you a boost. Climb over, open it from the other side. Sure. No need. 
Whoa! Okay, we like leaping. Just push. Uh, seems easier to open from that side. Ugh. Okay! On our way. I have cybernetics, man. You don't stay alive in this job. That, actually. Unlikely to dazzle. Make a good first impression, huh? Certainly no Corpo Plaza. No. But life's livable here. No worse places to raise kids. Randy's problems with the law. Those didn't pop out of thin air. True. But Randy takes after his old man. He'd find trouble in a nicer neighborhood, too. Holy shit, mate. You can go faster if you want. Apparently the worst city between the Atlantic and the Pacific. But I sure do love this view. Find it calming. I'm gonna end up fucking oh here. Scrapers actually seem pretty majestic out here. Not seeing what goes on inside. Memories? High stress, dirty backstabs, kind of pressure that gives you ulcers. Somehow, I just don't miss it. Got something for you. <laughs> Your piece? Had her a long time. Too long. I think it's time she found a new owner. To know what to say. Just promise you won't blow your foot off. Oddly specific request. Josh's husband did it. Drunk. This very spot. Which made this your special spot. Family landmark? Something of the kind. Now for the highlight of the evening. Up for a drink? Always. Something strong is sure to hit the spot. Now that I understand. To friendship. To friendship. You got any more of that? Two bottles of whiskey and a case of beer ought to be enough. <laughs> we'll see about that. Buckle your liver in. Gonna be a long night and a longer morning. <laughs> I'm gonna die. <laughs> Here's a good friend. The simple fact that I didn't die, it's amazing. With that. Well, colonizing the moon, and there's still no cure for hangovers. Well, at least we had fun yesterday. Yeah. Um, but now I gotta roll. Promised Joss I'd take her to see Randy. No rush either. Get your sea legs back. Take as much time as you need. Apologize to Joss for me. We kinda dined and dashed yesterday. And left puke all over the bathroom? Aw, oh, shit. <laughs> you sure you're good to drive? <laughs> Please. Former NCPD? <clears throat> I'm a pro on Hangover Highway. Be fine. Tell Randy, hey. Will do. See you later, V. Well, let's see what more we can do. Well, ladies and gentlemen, thank you for watching. This was the video. If you enjoyed, leave it a like. If you didn't, leave it a dislike.
If you have anything to say, please leave a comment. And if you want to see what the hell is going to be coming next on this mess, subscribe. And see you guys on the next episode.